Yo, what's going on people? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Sam and I'm a full-time seven-figure eBay and Shopify seller. In today's video, what I'm gonna be doing is taking you through an average day in my life. Nothing too special. I'm just gonna be showing you what I get up to in an average work day. So I'm just gonna show you what sort of tasks that I do, you know, all the work that I do. So I just woke up and the first thing that I like to do as soon as I wake up is read a book. So the book that I'm reading now is called The Feeling Is The Secret by Neville Goddard. I've read this already like twice, you know, it's a small book. This book basically teaches you about the subconscious mind you know it's basically like a law of attraction book it teaches you how to manifest in your life as you guys know i'm big into law of attraction i've got a bookshelf over there with primarily law of attraction books that's what i'm into so i'm going to read that i'm going to get on with my day and then afterwards i think i'm going to go over to the computer and then i'm going to start some of my e-commerce tasks for my ebay and shopify business so i'm going to let you know exactly what i'm going to get on with next see you in a bit all right so the next thing that i like to do is that i jump onto the computer and then i start doing a few bits of work now because because I've hired a couple people recently to answer messages and to do certain things I don't really do that much when it comes to my e-commerce businesses but the main thing that I'm doing right now because today is the 5th of October suppliers in China have been off work or on holiday since the 1st of October or for the past week or whatever but they're going to go back to work in the next three days so right now I'm just going to do a stock check and see exactly what stock I've got left and then what I might do later on is go over to the office and do a physical stock check just to see exactly if what my employee has put on the system matches up with what's actually in the office so I want to make sure that everything is in line and that's what I'm going to be doing right now oh and if you're new to my channel and you're not sure exactly what I do and you've never seen my face before I sell physical products through eBay Shopify and Amazon so I mainly focus on eBay and Shopify I don't really focus Focus on my Amazon stores too much and what I do is I import stock from China into my office spaces and then I ship out the orders one by one well not me but I've got a team that helps me do that so what I mainly do on a day-to-day -day basis now is just oversee a couple things when it comes to my e-com stores you know I find new products I import new products so I'm basically doing that but the main way that I spend my time on a day-to-day -day basis is by making videos editing videos for my YouTube channel so as you guys know right now I've got 13.4 thousand subscribers so my goal by the end of the year is to get to at least 15,000 subscribers obviously if I can blow up and get to 20k subscribers I'll be happy but that's what I'm mainly working on now so I'm going to be showing you what I get up to in terms of the YouTube stuff as well because editing and recording these videos takes up a lot of my time it takes me around three to seven hours I would say to edit one video and to record one video and to script it you know there's a lot that goes into operating this YouTube channel and at the end of the day this YouTube channel is a business in itself so I'm going to be showing you what I get up to with that I do a couple other things as well I do affiliate marketing in. I've got some blogs that I'm managing and I'm setting up a couple more blogs as well so there's a lot that goes into my day-to-day -day and I'm just going to show you everything it's not just e-commerce that I do and that's one thing I want you guys to be aware of as well is that when it comes to trying to create sources of income don't just focus on one I would definitely say focus on one source of income until you've got it to a point where it's stable and you know that you can focus on something else once you've got your income to a point where it is stable and everything's kind of automated I would say focus on creating more digital sources of income so I've Got an appointment at mercedes in the next hour i need to get my car serviced so i'm gonna head over there just gonna finish off some work so i'll see you guys in a bit We literally do this within half hour for okay. you because at the moment our loan cars you're going to have to fill them when you return them. So that's okay. the stipulation from one of our loan cars, and there's no fuel. So we, it'd, be, it'd be easier for you if you could just we could do it while you wait quickly. Is it definitely going to be half an hour? Yes. Yes. Okay. Is All that right. okay? Yeah, that's okay. Okay, let me just confirm everything. Teacher said I wasn't gonna be shit, so I grew up, dreamed and chased it. Okay. All this money I stacked, yeah. it got me feeling like I made it. I got a couple, ten, ten things now, man, I don't know lame. <laughs> Every day, same routine, trying to figure out ways to increase these wages. I pay my employees, yo, man, I be giving those pay slips. All I wanna do is just win, I ain't trying to tie like I'm doing shoe laces. I just wanna do it like I never done it before. Back, back then, I was. I, I had to break. All right, guys, so I just finished at Mercedes. No so I'm on my way to the office. I've got a few bits and pieces to sort out. An and I've got a few tips for you as well if you're shipping out orders by yourself. So stay tuned. Let's go. Get me this I have faith. I'll get big. 
All right, guys, so I just got to the office. As I said, I got a few things that I'm going to be sorting out here. I'm just going to go through some of the bookkeeping and some of the stock check. So all of the inventory is behind me right there. So I'm going to do that, have a quick glance at everything. But I just wanted to give you guys one quick tip when it comes to shipping out your items or even finding items in general. So as you can see, I've got these size boxes right here. And when it comes to finding a product to sell, whenever you're doing your product research and you're trying to find the winning product. And by the way, if you want to know how I find winning products to sell on my eBay store, watch the video that I'm going to link above. That video will show you a step-by-step -step process that I do when it comes to finding products and selling it on either my eBay or Shopify stores. But when it comes to finding a product, try and get a product that fits inside a large letter size box. So this right here is a large letter size box. So I'm just gonna assemble it so that you guys have an idea of what it looks like. So as you can see, this is what it looks like once I've put it together. And that's basically the size right there. So what I like to do is find products that are selling between you know, 30 pounds, $40, up to like $100. So I like to sell those type of products because there's gonna be less competition. So the reason you're gonna save money on postage if you use this type of box is because it's a large letter size box and in the UK, if you're using Royal Mail, this is the size that is the cheapest when it comes to posting your items. After this size, it's gonna be a little bit more in terms of postage. Once it gets a little bit bigger than this, it's gonna be classed as a small size parcel. And if it's a small size parcel, it's gonna be three pounds to ship your item. Whereas with this size, it's gonna be only around one pound or one pound 50, depending on what service you use in terms of first class, second class all of that stuff i've got this size right here let me just put this one together as you can see that's the size right there and this is also classed as a large letter size box as well you can get large letter size boxes in various different sizes depending on what items you're selling so that's my tip for the day for you guys those are the type of boxes that i use of course i use bigger boxes as you can see behind me i'm not sure but i got big boxes all types of boxes but when it comes to the main items that i sell i try to make sure that it fits in there so i'm going to finish off here and i'm going to go back home and work on the youtube side of things and if you guys want to know what label printers i use i don't know if you can see up there i've got one label printer up there i don't use that one but I got a couple label printers on my desk that I use every single day when it comes to shipping out my orders and printing out the shipping labels. I'm gonna leave a video above right there that you can watch where I broke down which label printers I use. But I'm gonna get on with the day, I'm gonna continue the work and I'll see you guys in a bit. Just finished off at the office and I'm on my way back home now. I'm probably gonna record a couple of videos or maybe edit, I'm not sure yet. But I just wanted to show you one thing that I've been doing recently, which is trading a lot of cryptocurrencies. I've been investing in a lot of currencies as well, Cardano, Bitcoin, XRP, just a couple coins. But today, I put around $800 into Shiba Inu or SHIB, S-H-I-B. And as you can see, it's already gone up to around $1,000. A lot of people are saying that this is the next coin. This is the next Doge coin that's gonna, you know, rise up. So if you guys wanna make some money, this might be the coin that you wanna get into. I'm not a financial advisor, but you know, I gotta help my subscribers out. But right now I gotta go home. Got a lot more work to do. If you want me to make more videos on cryptocurrencies, what I'm investing into, put in the comments down below, do crypto videos, and I'll definitely get onto it as soon as possible. But right now, gotta go home. See you guys when I get there. All right, guys, so I'm back home now and what I'm going to do is work on a couple videos. So I'm going to get all of the equipment and everything all set up, all the lighting and everything. On this channel, I normally release videos educating you guys on how you can make money on either eBay, Shopify and Amazon. But in this video, I wanted to do something a little bit different. I do vlogs every now and then. I probably got around four or five different vlogs on this channel. This channel started off by me doing a vlog. Comment down below and let me know what you thought of the video so far. And if you've enjoyed it, I may end the vlog off here. The time right now is 7 p.m. So I'm going to get these two videos recorded. I've got a couple videos to edit as as well so i'm going to edit these videos i'm going to record these two videos then i'm probably going to end the day off here so this has been an average day in my life if you found any value in it don't forget to press the like button and don't forget to add me on instagram as well because i'm going to start doing a lot more giveaways i'm going to put my instagram down below all right guys i'll see you on the next one make sure you stay safe out there peace